Hey Sagittarius, welcome back guys. So let's go ahead and get you a general reading. Let's see what's coming towards you guys within these next seven days. Now guys, please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does and leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. And there is no gender in tarot, guys. Reverse the roles as need be. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and see what's going on here with you. What is the overall energy here for my Sagittarius universe, Archangels, a spirit, angel guides, and guardians? Guys, as I'm doing this reading, I just happened to look up at my clock on my iPad, and it is 1111. Okay? So a very important message for you, travel. Something you're moving towards, someone is traveling towards you. Something is traveling towards you. I just heard in the speed of light. What is this universe? What is this overall energy travel? This also, to me right now, it literally just got the image of the six of um, swords energy. So something's about to get calm for you. Something's about to mellow out. It's moving towards calmer waters here, the truth, okay? I feel like there's a truth that's getting ready to be presented to you, Sagittarius. But this truth is going to bring in a peaceful energy, though. I do got to be honest with you. In your dream state. So something has been made clear to you in your dream states or in your dream state or it will be made clear for you. But the truth of the matter is that this truth that's being presented to you, whether it's someone physically coming towards you or you might have already gotten this energy in your dream state, it's about to change everything for you. OK, because there is a transformation here for you. What is this overall energy for Sagittarius universe? What is going on with Sagittarius, please? What's coming towards them within the next seven days? What do they expect? Or what can they expect? Answers. Wow. Answers, guys. This is crazy. So for some of you guys, you've been waiting for some truth. The answers are coming in. Within these next seven days, there's something that's about to change in your life. And it's going to be a major, major change. Okay? This may be a dream coming true. But it is the truth. Something is coming in. It's an answer. And it's going to cause a major transformation. It may even cause, for some of you guys, I got to be very honest with you. Not all tarot readings are meant to give you all this happily ever after energy. But it, when this truth comes in, it may cause you to move on. Okay, with the travel energy. It may cause you to relocate, move away from a situation because the truth has been revealed here. What is the overall energy universe? There's healing, empowerment, and animals. Okay. Your your animal, your spirit guide, your animal guide, there's it's coming through your dream state, I feel like. For some of you guys, things have been made clear to you in your dreams. And maybe you found it difficult to believe it, you know. Um, I don't know how much you guys really look into your dreams, but it's it's a well known thing unless, you know, I'm I, I may got and I may have it wrong, but according to what I understand, we all have different ways of looking at things. But when you dream of a rat, you know, there there could be some type of betrayal. You could have very well gotten a dream like that. That there was some type of betrayal that was done to you and now the truth is coming out. Now that it's like you are going what is it, deja vu. I just heard deja vu. Okay. But there is going to be you're gonna be empowered when this truth comes in, but it's also gonna bring you in some type of healing energy here. You know, sometimes we look at tragedy in our life as like, oh my God, why me? I'm a good person. I deserve to be loved. I deserve to love. I deserve to make good money. I deserve this. I deserve that. But the truth of the matter is that rejection can ultimately be a blessing. The truth is rejection can be a blessing. And I totally, totally believe that. I've witnessed it with my, my very own grown adult children. I've seen them go through some stuff. I have went through some stuff. And the truth of the matter is that sometimes I'm like, man, I really wanted that. That was going to be my blessing. But the truth was I was rejected that opportunity because I had a bigger, better blessing coming towards me. And if you're having a rejection that's getting that's currently going on for you here or that is being made clear for you, let me tell you something. This rejection is not the end of the world for you. This is not going to make you and break you, my love. On the contrary, you have a blessing behind that rejection here. Stay strong. Stay strong. Have your willpower. Understand that everything happens for a reason. The good, the bad, the ugly. Whatever comes towards you, just take it with gratitude. Because at the end of the day, universe, God, your ancestors, your archangels, your spirit guides, your spirit animals, they, they're all looking at you go through this. And you're being grateful for the experiences that, guess what? You're going to be given those blessings. 
There's a life purpose behind this, okay? There's going to be a major, major lesson that's going to be learned here for you. Like I said, for some of you guys, yes, a truth is coming out. You might have already dreamed of this. This is your deja vu. But it's going to cause a major transformation in your life. But the truth of the matter, it's, it's justice. It's good karma. It's you're being protected, my love. You are being protected. Even though for some of you guys, this may not be what you want to hear, but this is your protection. This rejection is your protection, okay? This rejection is a blessing, okay? What's going on for you, it's happening for you. It's not happening to you, okay? Take everything with stripe, guys. I know it's about some. this is about some major lessons here. Like I said, not everybody likes to hear these messages, but somebody needs to hear this message, okay? What is this overall energy here for my Sagittarius universe? What's going on with Sagittarius? Please help me give them clarity. What messages do we have here? The fates. So I feel this was all faded. You were meant to go through all of this. You know, everything that happens to us is already written in the big book, okay? We came into this world, there was a plan with it, okay? There was lessons we were going to learn, things that were going to come towards us, situations that were going to be presented, but at the end of the day, we're learning lessons. This was all faded here. Yes, you may feel abandoned right now. You may feel betrayed with the orphaned energy here. You may feel like people are walking away from you. You know, if this has to do with a relationship and because you end up walking away from a toxic um controlling situation, you feel like their entire friends and families turned their back on you, uh, it's okay, my love. It's okay. Remember one thing, and, and I know sometimes this sounds negative, but you came into this world alone, you're going to leave this world alone. So at the end of the day, okay, those people that are not meant for you, it's perfectly fine to walk away from them. You could abandon them now, okay? You can definitely abandon them now. You got this happy, happy. After everything is said and done, after everything that you are going through, okay? You're about to bring in some happiness for you. All this sorrow, all this pain, all this heartache, all this mental confliction, it's about to change, okay? All that glitters, okay? There's something beautiful that's coming towards you. Behind all this clarity, whether it's good or it's bad news, it's bringing in all the truth and it's bringing in all the clarity. It's this. It's time for you to, to separate from the situation. It's time for a nap, okay? Understand when I tell you something, if you're choosing to walk away from a situation, I know that you're going to feel heartbroken. You're going to feel abandoned. You're just going to feel like your whole world's coming to an end. But the truth of the matter is that you don't even understand that God is going to bless you with so much happiness, so much victory, so much success. If you were in a situation with somebody that you truly, honestly loved and they did not love you, can I tell you something? The next person that is presented into your life is going to love you more than you've ever been loved. Okay, somebody is being divinely guided for you. Whatever it is that you're going through here, all these negative energies have come to an end because you finally see the truth to a situation and you're being blessed. What is this overall energy here for my Sagittarius universe? What do we have here? What advice? What's coming towards in the next seven days? The Queen of Wands energy, your energy. Things are being made clear. I literally just... <laughs> I don't know if you guys have ever seen those commercials where a light bulb lights up on, on, on top of someone's head where they just like got that miracle moment. That's you. It's, it's something is being lit here. Okay. You got the three of pentacles energy here with the three of stars. So whatever did not work out for you in the recent past, God is, God is confirming, universe is confirming, your ancestors are confirming that you're going to do the work and things will work out for you in the very near future here. The Queen of Swords energy, truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. For some of you guys, like I said, you might end up finding out that there is a third party here with this Queen of Wands energy. She may end up being the one or he may end up being the one to come towards you and reveal a truth, reveal a secret with the moon here. But at the end of the day, yes, you might feel like you're going to be backstabbed. You might feel like this is the worst painful energy that you've ever ever gone through but the truth of the matter is you're gonna make it you're gonna make it for some of you guys this is some past energy you're gonna make it okay have some love for yourself have some compassion for yourself understand that you are worth the weight you are worth the the, the trials and tribute you are worth everything that you you can bring to the table and if this person did not know how to value you in due time in due time when you least expect it Okay, after you're done resting, rejuvenating and healing, guess what's going to happen? Someone is going to cross your path. 
Okay, someone is going to cross your path, someone that is not going to ever leave you, walk away from you, someone that's going to make a decision to be with you, someone as strong as you are, someone that's going to love you as much as you can love them. It's going to be a beautiful connection. I know right now this is all mumbo jumbo to you. You're in a lot of pain. You may be in a lot of pain or you're just going, getting, getting over the pain. But the truth of the matter is that I would really love for you to come back to this reading six weeks, eight weeks later, because generally my readings are for the next six to eight weeks. These these things can happen within that time. But you're going to hear these messages again. You'll be like, damn, she was right. I was going to heal. I was going to get past this, okay? You got the page of pentacles here, okay? So new offers are being being um presented to you. New opportunities. New people are coming in. Knight of Swords energy. Okay? You got the, the King of, of Cups, uh, Pentacles energy here too. New stable individuals. New opportunities. Yes, right now you're going through a very, very hard time. Okay? You might be ending a very hard time, but the truth of the matter here, Six of Pentacles, things are balancing off for you. Okay? Things are balancing off for you. You have somebody who's going to come in stable. Someone who's going to speak the truth. Someone who's going to want to be with you and only you. Okay, you are going through some trials and tribulations, but I'm here to tell you all will end well. You will have your, your happiness, your victory, your success. Whatever you've been going through will soon come to an end. Okay, all right, guys, I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if anyone is interested in a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.